Last night was good. No, we got it. Down. Solid twenty. Do you want some? Good. I could have it. I could deal with the cheeseburger. I'm white trash all the way. Macaroni and cheese. Doritos, Kool-Aid. I thought it was gonna be more of like a board meeting with a bunch of tables and a lot of people, but it was like a concert or something. weird lady who was sexually harassing me and asking me what I ate for breakfast. What do you eat for breakfast? I'm just so curious. I'm so sorry, but I, you know. I'm kids about this time. I'm just kidding. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Very strange. The fact that it was me kind of answering questions, even when they were stupid, some of them, it was more suited towards what I'm capable of enjoying. Hello. Hi, my friend. Hey, you nice to meet you. you. It's a little awkward meeting salespeople. Nice see to meet you. Very honored to see you. It's more awkward when they compliment you. Thank you very much for a great, great, mysterious presentation. Sometimes I think that they're making fun of me. Uh, you seem to be a uh, very outrageous. <laughs> <laughs> so I always, I always kind of have my guard up because I think that they're they're mocking me because it just doesn't seem right that they like me. We are ready to sell your records. Is that right? You had some very strange questions. Martin, you ever going to let us leave or Who no? Gives you you a, just need a rubber talking. alligator. My image and my personality is very childish. Can we get an ice cream cone machine to bring on tour? It's also very cartoonish. I'll sprinkle some sugar on that little kid's head and eat it. I wouldn't consider myself necessarily a nice person or a mean one. I got people skills. I usually give back whatever people give to me. Strangely, they, they don't seem generally affected by me here. They just look and they look away. Even in the Midwest, people at least have a look of disgust. Or the devil obviously has a great sense of humor, so that's always my biggest inspiration. And if God exists, he obviously has a sense of humor, I wouldn't be here. 2000. Let's go to the other place. Let's go to the place we were talking about first, the outside the street by the train station. I usually like to go shopping when I'm there. Kick my ass. You know, I called that guy up on the phone and I told him to bring it on. He never called back. Anytime I go to Japan, I like to buy toys. What are you, what are you guys doing? Going to Kitty Land. They always have all these great new gadgets that you can't find anywhere else. Hello? Hello? I want a Furby for Christmas. How many dirty mouths were on that microphone last put on there? One more dirty mouth. They were just uh, much more on the edge and much more out there than stuff you'd find at Toys R Us. Wow. Hi. How you doing? There's no way you can ever just take one picture or one autograph. Now it's what happens. That's kind of the trade-off that you have to make if you want to go out shopping in public looking the way I do. You gotta just keep walking. Maybe we can take a lap. Because it gets very contagious. I was really surprised that people were nice about it. <laughs> they weren't yelling obscenities or throwing bottles or anything like that. So time, time, please. Okay. As long as they're not trying to wound me, I have no complaints. Oh. Who is this, the offspring? <laughs> we saw one strangely out of place girl with uh, some beauty pageant banner. Where are you guys from? Uh, Panama. I know, but is there a beauty pageant? <laughs> uh, beauty contest, yeah. Today? And Miss International, no. October 4th. Egypt? This is crazy. Then it was like someone threw water on her because it was a million of them, like gremlins or something. They all wanted to take a picture. Hello, I, I'm from Brazil. I don't even know if they knew who I was or if maybe one knew who I was and they told each other. I just, I didn't know what to do. I felt like um, the Easter Bunny or something.
publicity. Oh yeah? Yeah. For the release of the album? Yeah. Okay. How long for? What's that? How long for? Uh, I'm leaving tomorrow. first 2000 there's a genuine sincerity to their enthusiasm I think that they appreciate the fact that I take rock and roll as far as I can they're crazy today they're gonna all be at the airport too don't be don't even think for a minute they won't be Where's my welcome wagon and farewell people Maybe they'll be downstairs. It was real important to me to go to Japan. Meeting a lot of the people that listen to my music was one of my biggest inspirations. October 2nd, 2000. So this is Post Human Records and Entertainment. This is some stuff to be approved. The album cover. And when you unfold the booklet, it unfolds in this manner. I've always I had the same level of excitement about making music, but now it seems so much more important because all of the blame that was put on me for Columbine. Damn, y'all right, Jason. Mm -hmm. Rocker, Maryland, Maryland, Maryland. This shotgun sounded like a cannon. The entire uh, incident, the way the media reacted, uh, the people who were involved, the way I was treated. What has Satan done for you? What has Merlin Manson done for you? It hurt me personally because my career is my life. It made me feel a lot like how I felt growing up because it was a lot of people um, beating you down and treating you a certain way for something that you're not even responsible for. I just really had to reevaluate uh, what I was going to do. How am I going to respond to this? How am I going to take this? And I wanted to come out and swing with both of this. I wasn't going to avoid the subject, I was going to take it head on. When I got with the band to write the record, it, it was the most important thing I think that I've ever done. It, it's a great feeling to write a song, but to be able to perform it, it takes on a whole different life. Yeah, 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 yeah. You create something that the only word I can think of to describe it is magic. I hope that this is um, America's worst nightmare. You know, I hope that we can disrupt the regimented lifestyle that people love to set up for themselves. Um, that's what rock and roll was intended to be, and that's what I am, and that's what I'm always going to be. And the day that I'm not is the day I quit.